What's up everyone, this is Brackus and I was going to talk to you guys today about uh, Rust modding and um, I like to use Magma, there's also Oxide, but I use I like to use Magma, It's uh, everything's done in JavaScript which is a pretty, pretty simple scripting language. But uh, just to get started you're going to need to go to the Magma forms, or the Magma website and then go to download. And I think, um, first of all you're going to have to get a server. So you can uh, you can get one from S SPS Player. That's who I use. Or anybody like that. Most of them are gonna go are gonna already have um, the Magma server mod under the mod manager. But it's still useful to download this, and I'll tell you guys why later. So go ahead and download this right here. Just click on it, download now, and store that somewhere um, that you can remember. So for the for the first thing, I'm just gonna tell you how to set up everything. You're gonna need a um, a text editor you can use notepad plus plus I can use sublime text so just you know um, Google sublime text and I use version 3 and they have a good uh, JavaScript um, editor I'll show you that right now and yeah so I've been working on a plugin called fractions ranks kits control points but anyways what it does is um, you pretty much you start off and you, uh, it tells you to choose one of the two factions, there's heroes and bandits, and from there you're teleported to either of the uh, the faction towns, and then you fight for the uh, the players, the p people in the factions fight for the center town, which we call war town, and I can show you that really quick as well. Let's see, three. Here we are, so you start off in here, you do slash hero, and this is just giving you an example of what you can do with, mag with the magma API. Alright, so right now it, uh, it says Heroes gained a new member of Arrakis. And this is the Hero Town. Um, and you, you can also. And there's, a, there's a lot of features too. You can do Hero, get teleported back to the Hero Town. Because I'm an admin, I can go to the War Town. And this is all done. I did all, all of this from scratch um, using just sub, the Sublime Text Editor. So War Town. And let's see. No one's here, so I can capture it. It says I captured the town for the heroes and everything. Um, there's also kits, get kit, and it's based on your faction and it tells you everything you get. Um, I set it up so that heroes get the MP5 and P250 and Kev, bandits get full leather and the M4 and a 9mm pistol. So yeah, that's uh, I mean that's what you can do with the uh, with the Magma API, and uh, I'll explain more about what the Magma API is later on too. So I'll go ahead and switch back to, uh, to what I was doing earlier. Let's see here. So you're gonna need a text editor. You're gonna need a um, server host, and it's gonna be about twenty dollars a month if you go with a fifty slot server. I mean, you just have to do it if you want to test your plugins or someone. If you can, if you can find someone else to volunteer their their server to, for you to test, that'd be you know that'd be nice, but not, it's unlikely. So get the mod, get a good text editor. Also, you're gonna need to go to this, um, this, this right here, this uh, form page. I'll, uh, I'll put this in the description so you can go there. And it pretty much tells you how. Like, there's no. I mean, Magma's so new that there's really no documentation for, uh, for the code. So, but this is a good way to work around that. You just need to download Jet, uh, JetBrains.peak, and it's going to. When you when you download it, you can um, see all of the here we are right here. You can uh, see all of the all the hooks, all the, uh, the when you when you get the player objects, you can see their names, their health, and everything like that. So it pretty much tells you what you can do. And if you don't know anything about APIs, um, the best way I can explain it is if if you're a construction company, you're not gonna go and build your own hammers and nails, right? You're gonna buy them from someone or use someone else's tools. This this is what what an API API is. It's a, it's a lot of the simple stuff is already done for you, so you can go ahead and start making your own plugins, right? You wouldn't want to. Every 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 developer doesn't want to have to access the player name, right? So that's already done for you. Just like um, a construction company wouldn't want to make every hammer; they're just gonna they're gonna use other people's tools to make their own projects. If that makes sense. And um, just for the beginning, in the next tutorial, I'm going to teach you guys just the basics of JavaScript. We're going to do it through just this uh, online text editor, and we're going to learn about variables, strings, ints, and output. And after that, we're going to actually get into the API. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the, the you know this quick 
um, introduction to the Magma API, and I'll see you next time.